Okay, so let's try this whole vlog thing again. So we are back to doing weekly vlogs and it's going to be set up a little bit differently. I'm going to um, basically record clips throughout the week and I'm going to kind of narrate the week for you at the end of the week like I'm doing now. And then I'm going to have a nice little montage slash um, message at the end of each week. Um, at the end of each video for the week and yeah, it's gonna be really cool. I hope you guys like the new setup and feel of my new weekly vlogs and Yeah, so let's just get right on to this week ah. Ah. This week started off Not so great. We were feeling under the weather Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. You're so cute. Mm. So, I have not been feeling very good. Um, <laughs> I've not been feeling very good. Um, I have a cold or something, so that hasn't been fun. Has it? No. Um, <laughs> yeah. I haven't been. <laughs> You're smiling about it. <sighs> like this morning I was talking to Ryan on the phone and I could not talk like I was losing my voice it was so bad so hopefully I don't lose my voice right now but yeah I've started this week has sucked because I don't feel tired so I'm not drained I know it's not the flu I don't feel like I've been hit by a truck yeah I don't feel like I've been hit by a truck but my whole nasal throat area is just not very nice right now. So, yeah, so mom, my mom is coming over. She's gonna play with Olivia a little bit and I'm gonna get a nice warm bath. It's gonna be amazing. Cannot wait for her to come over. <laughs> and show everybody, show it snowed outside. Look at all that snow. It snowed last week, didn't it? Yeah. 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 Where is Mickey's nose? Where's Mickey Mouse? Is Mickey on here? You see Mickey and Minnie? Where's Minnie's nose? There it is. You couldn't even see her do it. Whoops. Huh. Where is Mickey's nose? That it? There it is! Good job! <laughs> so yeah, that's what's happening today. Probably nothing. I just got my makeup on because I wanted to feel good. Even though I don't feel good, I want to feel good. And But I'm not going anywhere today. Yeah, we're just, we're just chilling. We're just chilling and having fun. And learning and growing. You give mom a kiss. <laughs> Thank you. But you missed my lips. Mm, I want a kissy. <laughs> Not your head. So yeah, Olivia is 13 months now. Almost 14. So that's pretty exciting. 14 months? Is it this week or next week that that happens? I don't know. This is my house right now. <laughs> yeah. This crazy mess. 
But I'm sick and it never stays clean. But she's all worth it. And that day it was a beautiful reunion with my mom because she came over for the first time after her household being sick. My dad was sick, so she didn't come over for like five days. Like five days, so yeah, it was like a big reunion for Olivia and my mom. And I'm making some delicious sweet potatoes. Right now they smell so good. In the crock pot. Puppy! Okay, all right. This is my life, like nearly 24 seven, just pulling this puppy dog. <laughs> And then on Tuesday, I was working on some family history stuff. So this morning, Olivia is going to be watching Elmo and or Mickey Mouse, because she loves those. And I am working on some family history stuff of Ryan's side of the family, because I got a letter from his grandma. She's actually 90 years old. Um, which is crazy amazing, and she knows nothing about her dad's family. So I am working on it, and I want to send her the information. I think she's really gonna love it. So that's what I've been working on this morning. And then I watched a Life Church series on Wednesday that just rocked my world. So a lot has happened today. Um, I watched a message series by Craig Rochelle through Life Church, and it's called, if you look it up on YouTube, it's called um, Life After Death, What Happens One Minute, One Minute After You Die, something like that, One Minute After You Die, and it's this whole series about what happens and then heaven and hell and it totally rocked me like so much so that I was bawling my eyes out at the end of that message series and I gave my heart to God again like I was bawling because I've kind of I wouldn't say well yeah I guess gone away from God and at one point through my early adult life I didn't really want to believe in God anymore so for a couple years I was really rocky like I was really on the border of being an atheist and it was it sucked it sucked it was a sucky situation but This is what I'm dealing with, so sorry for the background. But, I've been like slowly, my, I guess my heart has slowly been coming back to God and this message series with Craig just completely like rocked me. Like completely rocked me. And he's so good. The message was so good I actually like understood things that were troubling me and it made sense with him One, so two, three, that's what happened this morning I bawled my eyes out and today is okay. what's the date One, two, January 22nd yeah, 
Today is January 22nd, 2019, and I regave my heart to God. So, that's all I wanted to say. Hi, beautiful. Mm. What are you doing? Mm. We just ate some chicken and yumminess, huh? Mm. And fruit. We're a little sick. We both woke up with stuffy noses still. Huh. Stuffy noses. She's coughed a couple times. Can tell there's stuff in there, but it's not as bad as it could be, so. Then daddy came home after being gone for like a day and a half. So she was really excited. <gasps> Dad! Daddy. I'm videoing it. Daddy! Yeah, we're so excited. Hi. Hi. Maybe. Yeah. You're so cute. Give hug. Ah, I'm caught. Uh oh. Daddy's caught. Oh, you hear her? Uh -huh. Big hugs. You're so cute. I made it home. Olivia, Daddy's home. Yeah. Can you say da da? da. <laughs> but when Daddy came home, he started smelling up the entire house with his vehicle. It was wonderful. Well, Ryan hit another skunk. <laughs> yeah, he ate, he, not ate. He ran over a skunk. He doesn't remember it. He has no idea how, but he got to his vehicle after work and <laughs> smelled something on and in his vehicle. Put it in the garage when he just got home and it's smelling up the garage and the house. It smells really bad. I have no idea what it is, but I can only think of a skunk. He ran over a skunk before and his vehicle had to be outside for two weeks because of it, or else it would completely stink up the entire house, so it had to stay outside. And now I think he did it again, or the skunk randomly sprayed the vehicle for no reason out in the country. I have no idea. I'm so confused. But it smells bad. It's so bad. Huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? <laughs> Ugh. Makes me want to throw up. Gotta get this out of my house now. <sighs> Is that dad? Olivia? Yeah. Yeah? Is that dad? Where's dad? Is that dad? Say hi, dad. <laughs> Say peekaboo, dad. So the night before we had a big accident in our bed she peed the bed everywhere and she thought it was hilarious the next morning pee pees everywhere <laughs> huh you went pee pee everywhere <laughs> i just went everywhere all up your back and everywhere <laughs> yeah you yeah. cutie pie Aww. i love you okay Where's start the, the dishwasher Be shiny. Press it with your finger. Ready? Do the one, do it. Here we go, and then we hit start. Hit start over there. Ready? Ready? Oh, you did it! Wait for it, wait for it, listen. You hear it? Good job cleaning the dishes. Good job, Yay! Yay, clap, clap! 
clap, clap, clap. Olivia, go. Olivia, you gonna clap, clap, clap? Yay! <laughs> Yay! Clap, clap, clap. Yay! <laughs> okay. Okay, so my Project Life stuff came in the mail, finally. And I got a whole bunch of pocket sheets. I got the baby girl um, edition of this set, kit. What's it called, a kit, a set, something like that. And yeah, and then I have the album down here, it's pink. And yeah, I'm gonna be doing her baby album, like pregnancy slash first year album with all my stuff, so I'm really excited about it. Huh. And Olivia's eating some sweet potatoes. And Daddy just found out where the stench came from yesterday. There's a mouse in his engine area that's dead. Yay, a dead mouse he has to go out and get now. Yeah. Daddy just got the gloves and he's gonna go get it out of his vehicle. Out of his engine. Yeah. It's disgusting. He showed me a picture of the tail. Disgusting. And then my dad, Papa, got better, so he was able to come over this week finally. Is Papa here to play? Yeah? Papa's here to play? Is that him? Papa's here? Papa's here to play. He's here. Papa's here? Oh, 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 oh. Where's the thing? Someone's texting me out there. Is that Papa? Hi, you baby. Papa's here to play. What are you doing? Yeah, that's Papa on the picture. Yep. Yeah. Hold on. Let me do my hands too. You're so cute. <laughs> oh. Yeah, Papa's here in real life. Oh, my oh. God. It's like I want to show you the pictures. Yep. Where's the Papa? There's the Papa right there. Yep. <laughs> Whoa, Papa's getting dizzy. Hold on, Papa's getting dizzy. Oh, you are too. Hi. Okay, hold on. I gotta do one thing first. Rabbit. You don't want no rabbit either. You don't want no Yay! Yay! There's so much work, and then you get allergies, then it's all. Then Thursday morning. Nana brought over a big surprise for Livia, a nice little present. <laughs> Did she come in with a big toy? Oh, we're so excited! Woohoo! Wow! Yeah! What is it? Here. Nana, get it out of the plastic. There. Wow! Whoa! What did Nana bring you? Oh my goodness! Is that Look Mickey and Minnie? It's your own chair! Whoa! Mickey! Wow! Is that Mickey Mouse? Sit. Are you gonna come and sit with sit, Rudolph? Sit. Right here? 
right here. And then even my sister Faith, her aunt Faith, and her fiance Wynn came over and had a nice visit with us. And she was super shy with Wynn. She like is in love with him, I think. And she has a crush. And she's all like bashful. It's hilarious when he's over here. <laughs> Wynn's gonna get you. He's gonna get you. <laughs> Aww, like my nose. she likes you. <laughs> oh man. Uh. <laughs> Want Eskimos? Let's get Eskimos. Aww, that's so sweet. So yeah, a lot happened this week. That's our week, and we will be doing this again. I will be rolling out weekly videos every Sunday. That's gonna be like my routine. So every Sunday we're gonna roll out a weekly video. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy your this next week, and let's roll the music and start the montage with my message for the week. Who do you wanna become in 2019? That is the important question, isn't it? That's the purpose of everyone making resolutions in the new year. We all want to grow and be better in different ways. This week, I learned that it's about the small things, the little habits we can start or get rid of to better ourselves and bring us closer to who we want to be. Our life is a sum total of all the small decisions that we make. Spending more time with family, reading your Bible every day, spending less time on social media, even the habit of flossing your teeth or making your bed. The small habits you create over time make you the person you want to be. So again, who do you want to be by the end of 2019? Do not let your past failures distort your identity. Failing at your past goals or resolutions does not make you a failure. I will tell you that I want to be a godly mother, a godly wife, freer financially. I want to be a healthy person and recognize my body is a gift and a temple for God. A healthy identity creates positive habits. Zechariah 4.10 says, Do not despise these small beginnings, for the Lord rejoices to see the work begin.